What's up gamers, welcome back to the channel, and boy do I have a treat for you. By now I'm sure we've all heard about VTubers, who are known for making some of the greatest content on the internet. And just like with every streamer, they even have their own dedicated clips channels. Dedicated to highlighting everything from their streams that's notable and hilarious. Because for whatever reason, they don't want to hire an editor to rake in that ad revenue themselves. But I guess people are already sending them their life savings, so I guess it wouldn't add much. For example, if you were trying to sell coke, wouldn't you want to put your ad on this video? Click and drag. Oh. Well, I guess it all makes sense to me now. Their streams just aren't funny, and shit like this is all they have clips of. But if you're wondering, this is more than just a boob joke. Come on, is that really the limit? That's really it? That's not realistic. Really? What's this? <gasps> wow. If shit like this is the highlights, then the rest of the stream must be even worse than this. But I think we need more proof for that, so let's take a look at even more of these hilarious and cute clips. And if you somehow finish this video, you might want to check into the nearest vent, because there'll be a bag of cocaine waiting for you. You know, as a reward for being able to make it through this gauntlet. Close enough. Close enough. Focus. I'm losing focus. Okay, that was... I got too early. <laughs> Whack! Whack! Whack them all! Whack, Whack. of Sentinel! Random noises! Yay! Yay! Now I'm gonna tell you guys a little secret, alright? Now, VTubers, and anime in general, is meant for fucking kids. You know, all those hilarious noises they make, as well as their high-pitched voices, is designed specifically to appeal to children. What I'm about to show you is the only part of their characters not intended for kids. Well, it flattened. This one I thought I couldn't get any flatter. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. get some. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> this part's just fan service to all the weebs who give them money day after day. From a marketing standpoint, they're doing pretty well since they're marketing to both kids and their loyal cash cows. Which just so happen to be the same cash cows that the Clips channels market towards. I mean, just look at some of this stuff. To quote a song about two respectable African-American men in Paris, it's provocative, it gets the people going. So right now I don't quite get the appeal of this stuff, but maybe by watching more, I can develop Stockholm Syndrome and learn to love it. Fun fact, in Australia we only have the great Jesus fucking Christ, this bitch's voice is annoying. Next video. I can't do a flip, but I can do a uh, sweet 360. Here we go. Okay, it wasn't exactly a 360. Yeah, and don't worry, I'm wearing shorts underneath this skirt, so if you guys see anything- Bro, what the fuck is that noise? Did this man really have to pick the most ear-shattering noise for his videos? And also, this just looks like a family-friendly version of the hot tub streams you see on Twitch. Thing. They're just shorts. Don't get too excited. You think that's gonna stop me? <laughs> look, look at that! Oh my god! I was just stretching! I didn't realize that the camera was right there! Ah! Don't look! Don't look! Don't look! Don't look! This reaction looks so fake. Which is probably because it is fake. Because no one's gonna get legitimately upset over a 3D model. But she of course has to play it up, because otherwise her stream would be boring, because she's just bouncing on a trampoline. It's not that exciting! You can find something better on Google Images, okay? OnlyFans people should listen up, because she speaks the truth. They're just shorts! They're like workout shorts! Look! Okay, for some reason I'm backwards right now, but I think it'll flip at some point. Ah, don't look, don't look, don't look, don't look, I have to use my computer, but I can't do it without playing forward, and for some reason the camera's backwards, don't look! Stop! Stop! Where's the window? Where's the picture window? Stop! Okay. Alright gamers, get your tinfoil hats on, because I got a conspiracy for you. She did this intentionally. Are we really supposed to believe that it just magically flipped on her, and put her in a compromising position? Next clip. Look at, but I, I made an exception, which is really cute. So cute! Look at that! Oh my god, that is so cute. A 
very cute. Bruh! Made... Made this! The person who drew this is a very cute... They went to a maid cafe. Oh they my god. went to a maid cafe. For those of you who have a father, let me explain what a maid cafe is. These are very fine dining establishments in which all the waitresses dress up as maids. The clientele are treated as masters as opposed to losers who go to maid cafes. These cafes are rather fetishized, making them popular among weebs. These cafes were also designed to help people deal with the fact that they don't have intimate relations in their life. Which, it can be assumed that this perfectly describes the person who sent in that picture. No one's a maid cafe! Have you been to a maid cafe? Have you been to a maid cafe? I've been to a maid cafe. Have you been to a maid cafe? Really? I have. It was really cute. Oh my god. No, I've never been to a maid cafe before. Really cute. Really nice. I want to go to a maid cafe. made really cute food. I want I want them to make me so moe moe cute. We should go to a meat cafe. We should. <laughs> mm. Oh my god. Again, why the fuck do people enjoy watching this shit? Yeah, I'm flexing right now. Yeah, I went to a meat cafe. Yeah, the meat. Oh. The meat are cute. Yeah, oh. whatever. Yeah, they, oh. they made me cute, cute drinks. And the cute curry. Mm. Yeah, that's right. I'm very jealous. <laughs> I don't even know how to describe this part. But to me, it seems like she's just trying to get all the weebs jealous. But who knows, maybe she might be working for the maid cafes. And with that being said, there's your second conspiracy theory for the day. Now, this guy has an outro, and I'll just put it out there. This is a work of art. What I especially love is that he forgot the S after the channel. So you know, great work there. The song though is the shit. This next clip is probably one of the most awkward things you could have happened to you. I don't want to put on sunscreen. I know, it's greasy. It's greasy. <laughs> and it gets in your eyes and it hurts. And I feel yucky. Yeah. Mm. 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 Confirm. How relatable. Mom single. <laughs> they want to know if you're single. Oh shit, the Xbox Live kid's gonna fuck your mom. Oh no, there is a Papa Mori. <laughs> there is a Papa Mori. God damn it. Yeah, yes. so sorry guys, just got a hubby. I don't know what else to tell you guys. Um, <laughs> he's he's trying to sleep right now, but I don't think... That, that probably <laughs> won't happen when we start singing. No, it won't. Oh boy. No, it won't happen. <laughs> As you can tell, they don't know how to react to that question. So I guess big ups to the person who asked it. But is it just me, or does this clip feel like a sitcom with the laugh track removed? What are so not cool? Anyway. So I decided to take a creative liberty and add everything back in myself. and it hurts and I feel yucky yeah. I don't like it. <laughs> mom single <laughs> they want to know if you're single oh no there is a papa mori <laughs> there is a papa mori yeah so, yes. sorry guys she's got a hubby I don't know what else to tell you guys <laughs> um, he's, he's trying to sleep right now but I don't think that, that probably <laughs> won't happen when we start singing no it won't <laughs> Now it's time for the main event, the single greatest piece of content that a VTuber has ever produced. I am of course referring to the legendary interview to promote the blockbuster hit, Morbius. Now settle in, grab your popcorn, get a drink, maybe even some drugs, I'm not gonna judge. Wow. Hi! Hi! Nice to meet you! Wow, it's so nice to meet you. You have a wonderful voice. Uh, I hope that uh, you, you sing some music sometime too. You sound great. Thank you. Hi, 
Oh, I appreciate the question, and uh, you, 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 I, I love your character. It's so cute, um, uh, and, and your outfit is great too. It almost looks like a Gucci outfit. It's uh, very, very nice. It really uh, such a, a, a unique little character. It's um, mesmer mesmerizing. Um, so uh, anyway, I forgot the question. Um, I mean, it, I could ask you the same question. I did have to work out. I have lots of push-ups, um, but you look pretty strong too. I mean, I bet you have uh, 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 pretty strong muscles and, uh, you know, you just have to work out and eat well. I don't know what your diet consists of, maybe mice or, um, you know, small birds, but, uh, um, uh, you know, uh, that, that always helps. Keep the protein intake coming. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm a soul. You learn something new every day. You sound like my type of uh, my type of fox. I hope that audiences and other characters enjoy it too. Thank you. Just imagine being Jared Leto in this situation. You've been in meetings all day, you don't really want to be there anymore, then your producer puts an animated Japanese fox girl on your computer screen. And all you can really do is just smile and wave and call her cute. Well, I guess he doesn't smile or wave since he's been doing interviews all day. Once Jared had the opportunity to leave, he took it and ran away. Just the sheer awkwardness of the situation makes this one of the best interviews of all time. However, there's also another interview starring the Batman, but that's a close second. Hello, my name hey. is Laplace oh. Darkness. Nice to meet you. Nice, nice to meet you. Hi. 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 <laughs> that's really good makeup. I love it. <laughs> Thank you. Well gamers, that's all I have for you today. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. It would really help out the channel. I'll be increasing my upload frequency over the summer. So I'll be trying to have at least one video out per week. And with that said, I'll see all you motherfuckers next time. <laughs>